outside and that's when you buy raincoats, right? Like <laughs> Brent's going on a work trip soon and he needs a raincoat. But it still doesn't make sense to me because it's gonna be like 90 degrees where he is. So I just I'm a California girl and I don't get it. But that's what we're doing today and guess what? We're gonna vlog in public. How do you feel about it? Good. You feel good? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I feel like it'll be whatever. It'll be really awkward, but whatever awkward. <laughs> He's really playing. He's really nervous right now. <laughs> oh no, is my elbow ashy? <laughs> Get <Ew. out> <laughs> So here we are, how do you feel right now? Uh, a little nervous. It literally took me five minutes. Well, not five minutes. It took me a good minute to turn on the camera. <coughs> I was just so nervous. Oh. It feels so awkward. <laughs> what do you think, Emmy? So because it's the middle of summer, where are we going to find green clothes other than a thrift store? Crossroads Trading Co. Oh, little video inception. Yes, worth it. It's not as bad when you're outside. Why does that make a difference? Uh, because inside gives you claustrophobic awkwardness. <laughs> what? It's a thing. Google it. Just kidding. It's not a thing. Maybe it's a thing. I don't know. <laughs> I'm making it a thing. But the fact that that lady like walked right in front of me while I was doing that like my little fashion show and didn't care. Because she didn't know we were care. filming. But I just feel like lots of people don't even notice or care. Because look, it's just what you do. Look, they're doing it. Oh no, she stopped. Because people walking. Walking. They're taking pictures. There's a difference. But still, it's like the same thing. Everyone's doing it. So. Everyone's doing it. She's doing it. Look, she's walking. Everybody's doing it, babe. It's because she's like, that girl was in middle school. She's too young to be embarrassed. Yeah, but why can't we be like middle school? Why do we have to be embarrassed? Oh, puppy. Because of life experiences. <laughs> well, we're getting real deep here, aren't we? <laughs> so, just to clarify, I don't actually want to act like a middle schooler. I already look like one. I don't need to act like one. And I also don't want to vlog in public just because everyone else is doing it. I did this because I have a problem with caring about what other people think of me. It's such a deep-rooted issue that it keeps me from doing a lot of things. For example, I had a business about two years ago that was meant to encourage and help women. And I stopped doing that business because I was so concerned about what other people thought of me. And it's a really, really sad thing to admit. I made a lot of excuses as to why I stopped doing it, but that's the reality. I cared so much about what other people thought of me. So I stopped. Um, there's been things like writing or doing these videos where I almost don't do them sometimes or I don't write sometimes because I'm so concerned about what are people gonna think of me are they gonna think I talk too much are they gonna think I'm too serious whatever it is I miss out on the opportunity to encourage other people because I'm so consumed about what are people gonna think of me there's been 
when I was pregnant, there was a time that my friend brought me a cupcake that I was really, really craving. She surprised me, brought it over, and all I could think about was, oh my gosh, my house is messy right now. What is she gonna think of me? Mind you, I was seven or eight months pregnant, so my house being messy is like kind of a given. But I was just so consumed with it that I wasn't even able to like express my excitement or my thankfulness because I was just like, oh no, oh no, she's gonna think I'm a messy person, she's gonna think this and that about me, and that's crazy. So it's not always like these big career situations, but it's like everyday life. Like if Brent and I in the past were out in public and he like was kissing on me or holding me or something, I would get weirded out and make him stop because what are people gonna think? Are they gonna think like, we're so immature and like we can't keep our hands off of each other or like we're so young and in love and like it's not even real or like whatever craziness that I was concerned about what other people were gonna think of me. Like it's insane how deep rooted this is. There's times where I don't send an encouraging text to my friends because I'm like, what if they think I'm overbearing? Or I don't encourage a stranger because what if they think I'm weird? Just all of this stuff and so it's not like I'm like, don't judge me, only God can judge me. I don't care what you think. Like it's not some bratty thing like that. It's like a legit, issue that keeps me from adding value to myself, from adding value to others, and it's just not a way that I want to live my life anymore. I don't want to live my life in fear. I don't want Emmy to grow up worrying so much about what other people think that she can't be herself. There's been times where I alter my personality because I'm so concerned about what are people going to think of me. Yeah, girl, she's right here. You can't see her, but here she is. Anyways. So, vlogging in public is obviously not important in the scheme of life, but it's a tangible way that I can work on something that scares the crap out of me, that I can work on not caring about what other people think. And it's something that I can do often, as well as other things in my life. So. That's why that was such a huge deal for me, and I hope that this encourages one of you people out there to know that uh, you aren't alone if you have a problem with caring about what other people think, because I think we all have that problem. So yeah, have a good week.